Welcome everyone, you may be in a situation where the audio on the Xbox Series S isn't working, here's how you fix it. The first thing is I want you to try is a reboot on your Xbox Series S. In order to do this, the best way is on the controller, hold down the Xbox logo until you see this page, and then you just want to navigate to restart console, click on that one, give it a little bit, and then retry the audio, let's say if it was inside of a game, and stuff like that. If it's working, you're good to go. If it isn't working, the next thing you want to do is check the HDMI cable. So first of all, make sure the HDMI cable you're using came from the original Xbox Series S. The reason why is because you may be in a situation where you know your HDMI cable you're using doesn't support the high resolutions properly, which means maybe you can't output the high resolutions, however, with no audio. So you know that's obviously gonna cause an issue. Just make sure you're using the original uh, HDMI cables. If you can't, you know, use that, try another HDMI cable instead also try uh, lowering the resolution just by opening up settings and then you just want to go to general tv and display options resolution and then just lower this down see if that solves the issue of course if it solves it you're good to go another thing is uh, if it doesn't solve the issue open up settings here then navigate to general and you just want to find here volume and audio uh, output and HDMI audio, make sure this is set to stereo uncompressed. If you have some other options, you can play around with those as well. I only have two, which is stereo uncompressed. If you have this to headset format, what that means is the audio is only going to come from the headset on your controller. Just keep that in mind. If you're having issues with the headset audio not working, you may just want to switch that to headset uh, format right there. Then you see here, headset audio, you can mess around with this as well. So if you know you're having issues with that, you can always just change that around. Another thing as well is you can go to additional option, uh, options. You can play around with turning on or off, allow a pass through and mono output as well. You can play around with these settings here. See if one of those settings will fix the issue. And if you're messing around and none of these are working, then it could just be something as simple as your TV doesn't have audio on. So the best way to check this is you just go onto like live TV, see if that's working. If it is working, uh, what you can do is you just have to go back and you know something is really wrong you may need to contact microsoft uh, to get a repair on your series s so i recommend you just i'll leave a link in the description for the um for the repair website you have up to five years warranty don't forget uh, when it comes to the xbox series s and the reason why is if you're in the uk and eu it's law that you have five years warranty on your items so good for you just make sure when you fill out the repair request if it asks you use the consumer law route uh, if you have if you're in any other country you have one year limited warranty uh limited warranty just means if the product is faulty you get a replacement if you you know drop test your xbox series s of course they're not going to give you a replacement now uh, another thing as well just make sure you don't have anything plugged in to the xbox series s you know controller itself or if you have any other controllers connected disconnect those as well and i mean really once you've done all those things, you've exhausted all your options. So, you know, you could also just try using the headphone audio from your Xbox Series S instead. So just plug in a headset there and then just use that instead of the TV. But really, that's all there is to it. So hopefully at the end, you can get, you know, a solution, whether that's for repair or just through these tips and tricks. Uh, do let me know if you did get things working in the comments. With that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye bye.